All right, hi Scorpio, this is going to be your love message. Okay, this is for past, present, and future. This is for Scorpio placement, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Take what resonates, leave what does not. If you're cross-watching for a Scorpio, this could play out from your point of view. All right, Scorpio, yeah, cross-watches. Um, Scorpio, choose which side of the story you're on in this situation and take what resonates and leave what doesn't. So how we're doing this is I'm gonna put a song, I'm putting songs on shuffle. The first like love song that comes up is gonna be the title for your reading. And I'm gonna link the song in the description box below some of you guys may have two songs so i'll pick which i'll pick a song to add for the title and then i'll make sure i put both songs in a description box okay i'll do song one and song two try to watch them with lyrics i'm gonna try to put them i'm gonna try to um find the ones that have lyrics so that you guys can listen to the song and watch it with the lyrics okay so let's see what scorpios let's see what song comes up for you guys oh you guys got black bonnie um, just like Pisces. So you guys could be dealing with a Pisces or somebody may have Pisces in your chart. Or you and this person may have, since Pisces rules the 12th house, you guys may have like a 12th house synastry, synastry going on. But Pisces got this song too. I feel like you and this person, you guys are like rebels, both of you guys in your own ways. Like both of you guys may, it's like you guys against the world type love. Either you have this with somebody or you're going to. So if you're not dealing with a Pisces or somebody that has that in their chart, you and this person have a 12th house synastry. Like that's very intense. Like you guys could have gotten into trouble with the law together or this person has or you have or somebody may work in the law or something like that. This person trusts you to lead too, Pisces. This person sees you as, I mean, Pisces. Wow, Scorpio, this person sees you as their ride or die. You guys could be Pisces with Scorpio placements as well for some of you guys. For if you're a... Yeah, this person sees you as somebody that... Yeah, like you're... Let's see, what's Scorpio? Some of like and Venus in love. This person gets aggressive with you, but they're not super possessive. They may not be as possessive as you, but they're, they could be a bit aggressive, right? We got grief. Uh, I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Whether you or this person had to lose, each, one of you guys had to lose each other to appreciate someone here. Or somebody's, somebody's going to not really realize how much you bring to the table, how hard you're riding for them until you park, until you stop. All right, and sometimes it's like that until you, you know. Yeah, envy, similar to Pisces. So you guys, again, if it's not a Pisces, there's a 12th house synastry that you guys have with somebody or that you're going to have with the person that's coming in or somebody that you're going to end up having this connection with. We got envy. So your first song so far is Black Bonnie. I was going to use that for Pisces, but I'm going to stick to... um the song i'm gonna stick to the original title which is foreplay but again if there's a different song that comes up for you guys i'll link both okay and the i am the same as everybody but with different challenges here okay so somebody could have did something out of envy and jealousy here they could have let their ego get in the way and we have acceptance this person there could be some envy between you and this person that may contribute to your attraction similar to what i was telling pisces right sometimes that type of it can it can be healthy sportsmanship but just make, you know, just make sure it doesn't get out of hand. So you guys aren't competing with each other, okay? We got acceptance. I am learning that, I am learning to accept the things that I cannot change. I also feel like for some of you guys that are breaking up with somebody or leaving somebody behind and getting into new connections, your ex is going to be very jealous of this. We got change. I understand that nothing can grow or evolve without movement. So yeah, some of you guys are evolving and you're changed. There could be a dynamic between you and someone that's changing or you're changing as a whole. And you could be leaving somebody behind. All right, so let me write down the first one. <laughs> so first, second, we got Scorpio. Yeah, this is like, it's giving Bonnie and Clyde vibes, but um they turn on didn't they turn on each other in the movie so be careful with that okay you guys again just you know be careful with that this is grief here for scorpio and love scorpio and
We got finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So somebody could be losing a job here or losing money or could have lost a job or will be. All right. Let's just end me. Somebody could be jealous. The, somebody could be jealous that the other person is doing better than them financially. Here, we got forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. So again, yeah, some of you, yeah, there could have been a lot of ego involved in this connection here for some of you guys. What's this acceptance? Somebody could do like scams and stuff, and we have um, make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps that you were guided to take here. So some of you guys could be getting to know somebody new. This person is going to accept all of you. All right. But you're being told to just kind of like, don't try to force nothing. Let this person, you know, let this person love you for who you truly are. Okay. Some of you guys are going to be uh, something about your inner child, your inner child wounds. You guys are going to be healing with each other here. It's going to be, it's, for some of you guys, you have a very innocent but intense connection that's coming in or that's somebody that you're getting to know right now okay and for others of you you're gonna have to accept somebody for who, in a relationship dynamic and just who a person is if you want this to work somebody is just not going to change you can't change people getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other your bond deepens so you could be deepening your bond with somebody again some of you guys are connecting to somebody new here okay for some of you guys, some of you guys, yeah, it was a relationship that is over. It's no second chances. It's not coming back. It's dead for good. All right. What's this beef in finances and career? You got the runner and then the snake. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious. Look over your shoulder. The other one. And then we got the runner. So somebody could be, somebody here is a snake. Somebody may see you that way. You see somebody this way here. Okay. Somebody here is just all about money. All right. What's this? Uh, the Grim Reaper. Yeah, the relationship is over. No second chances. Grow tr and transform your life. So somebody here could have been, only been with you for money or or this is how somebody th felt about you. Somebody could have been using somebody here. All right. Somebody here could have been taking money from you. What's this envy and forgiving and money? We got Cupid's arrow. Have faith. Love is coming. A surprise invitation or meeting and hesitation. So... Scorpio, you again. Some of you guys, if you're if you're feeling envious about envious about other people being in love, you have you have love coming in. You have that coming in here. Okay, somebody could be if you have a healthy and beautiful relationship. Somebody people could be jealous of that for you guys as well. So just be mindful of who you tell and share your stuff to. Or this could be your person who needs to be mindful of this. You guys may want to kind of keep things to yourselves for a little bit. Especially if you guys, if this is already existing connection or relationship or marriage that you guys are trying to work through together, you may want to keep it under wraps. For those of you, for those of you, if this is like a new person, again, just you know, it's keep it to It's hitting. It's coming. It, it, it's coming in. Okay. Yeah, somebody. <laughs> some of you guys. Yeah, I feel like somebody's taking you from somebody. I'm sorry to put it that way. Or somebody's taking somebody from somebody. Somebody could be hitting somebody could have been hitting somebody could be hitting somebody up in the DMs. So we have now down in the DM with uh Yo Gotti and Nicki Minaj. Somebody here is very persistent, or they've been persistent in getting you. This could have started out in the DMs or something like that on social media. Okay. What's this acceptance and make the effort? Yeah, we got the snake, and we got not today. Somebody uses a lot of filter on their pictures too, so just be mindful of that. Um, I'm gonna so that's gonna be a second song for you guys. Yeah, somebody's girlfriend is choosy or somebody's man is choosy. Somebody, yeah, it's a lot that goes down in the DMs and somebody's DMs. Yeah, so what's another song here? We got SWV by um, Summer Walker. I'm going to, I'm, I'm just going to, this will be the third, this will be the last song here I put. So it's three songs for you guys. Scorpio, you got the most songs so far. 
Pisces got two, you guys got three. Somebody could drive a Tesla, a Tesla or a nice car. Yeah, I just feel like somebody's friends are envious of something that you have with somebody. Or if there people are going to be envious of this. I feel like some of you guys feel weak in the knees for somebody. Yeah. Also, a lot of, I feel like a lot of you guys like the, you're going to like the sex with somebody or you like the sex with the current person that you're with. You like how they touch you. You like, you know, there's a lot of, you guys may take a lot of baths together, showers together. You guys may like to use ice, toys, all types of things. You guys may, to, you guys may like to have sex in the car or something like that here. We got the snake competition yeah there's competition here about something this could be somebody's co-worker could want them or i don't know anyways somebody can have an affair with the co-worker or something i don't know i'm getting competition a lot of like weird energy here is scorpio's reading of course but i thought this person is having a hard time letting you go scorpio competition enemy clever malicious look over your shoulder the other woman so you may have to forgive this. Somebody, there could have been infidelity. Somebody's obsessed with your vagina or your penis, Scorpio. Or they're gonna be. Or you're obsessed with somebody's penis or vagina. Flip it and switch it. Somebody may wanna compete for you now. I'm, I'm just getting that. Somebody here. There's a lot of forgiving that needs to take place here between you and somebody or just you need to forgive your past, especially if you've been cheated on a lot, lied to a lot and things like that. You may have a hard time trusting people, especially newer connections. Not today, not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, call or person, boundaries and still angry. So somebody still could be mad at you or you could be still mad at someone here. All right. I just feel like there's a lot of forgiveness that needs to be had here with yourself and for another person. All right, surrender messages for uh, Scorpio placements. Somebody could be avoiding or ignoring somebody's messages. We got to surrender your belief in scarcity. Uh, the universe is asking you to, to open to the infinite nature of abundance. In this way, you can remove blocks in your life and succeed beyond your wildest dreams. So you could be, again, with this finances and career, somebody could have made an impulsive decision due to their finances. Maybe they felt financially insecure and they could be regretting this decision here, not, not taking you serious, not putting in effort, cheating on you, backstab, whatever the hurt, whatever caused this to be over or whatever. Somebody could, somebody could also be going through changes in their career. They, something about their finances is transforming and changing. So there's there's a loss of something, a loss of money. Somebody could be in debt, but somebody has a scarcity mindset that's spilling that is it stems from their stability or lack thereof in finances, and it's spilling over into love. So somebody here could be very money hungry, very money and career focused. All right, somebody lacked emotional stability growing up, and they overcompensate with that through finances and career. Somebody's like an overachiever when when it when it comes to like their education and their career and stuff like that. Okay, what's this? What's a surrender message for Scorpio? Somebody could drive an EMT or work in a hospital. We have um, surrender the idea you can fix someone. Yeah, you you guys may have Virgo in your chart. You could be dealing with the Virgo here, okay? But you can't fix nobody. People are gonna be who they're gonna be always and forever unless they want to change. And yeah, surrender the idea you can, and even if a person wants to, that takes time. Surrender the idea. That's why you need to accept a person and situation for what it is. Either you can make the effort or you move on. Okay. But I just feel like somebody's going to always be a cheater. <laughs> somebody's going to always, there's always going to be third parties. There's always going to be lies. There's always going to be something here. Okay. Um, yeah, surrender the idea you can fix someone. It's time for a relationship to shift. It doesn't work to try to fix someone. Each person must be accountable for his or her own healing. Yeah, again, some of you guys, maybe both of you guys need to forgive each other or forgive your own wounds here. This could be childhood, past exes. This could be betrayals from friends. It could be anything. You guys both, I'm getting a mirroring energy here. You guys both need to heal. Also, there could be, yeah, there's something that needs to heal here, okay? Somebody could be obsessively thinking that there's another woman or another man. It may not be. For some of you guys, use your discernment. It could be. All right. 
for some of you guys that may not be the case this could be somebody here could be just severely and yeah surrender fear okay so some of you guys if there isn't another woman or another man somebody who's just very insecure again if this is somebody that you guys already have history with and you guys are rekindling you're trying to fix things maybe this person thinks that you're going to cheat on them again or they're, you're, you think they're going to cheat on you again or you think that this is going to be a repeat of the past you know if it's a new person maybe you think oh this person's going to cheat on me like my ex did you know it's like you got to surrender fear you guys are very, you know, you're fearful right now, okay? Some of y'all are just, some of y'all are blocking this off because you're scared. But you gotta, you, some of y'all need to make the effort. This person is gonna be your ride or die, Scorpio. I honestly feel like this person is gonna really be, this person is some of you guys, you got somebody that's here to stay. And some of you guys need to make the effort to be a better person for this, for your partner, for this person, if you want this to work. Especially if you were the ones that fucked up. And if this is not the case, if that's, and then for some of you guys, if this is like, you know, you've been cheated on or, or, you know, let this person, give this person time to show you that they care. Give this, give people space to make the effort here. Don't do everything for everybody. Don't, don't come on so strong. Let somebody, let somebody else do it. Surrender fear. Let go of the fearful stories you are telling yourself. Stay in the moment, focus on solutions and celebrate every baby step forward. Yeah, a lot of, somebody here is very insecure here trust issues big time surrender stubbornness if you're tenting up or taking a rigid stance about something gently observe yourself and become more yielding this will help you communicate more lovingly with yourself and others somebody here doesn't really know how to communicate because they communicate from a place of scarcity fear lack and insecurity and low self-esteem so some you know that, that that's gotta change something has to change right you can you can only fix yourself you can't fix someone okay and if somebody that no longer matches with you then you just you know you release and you move forward so scorpio this was your love message like comment and subscribe and i'll talk to you guys later bye